for Waterford, designers of the famous New Year's Ball in New York's Times Square. 2009 brought a final countdown to bankruptcy. It's a devastating setback for one of the world's most famous luxury brands, celebrated for fine glassware, crystal sporting trophies, and presentation pieces, even Ronald Reagan's jelly bean jar. I don't think anyone can quite get their head around what's happened, what a huge blow this is to British industry. In fact, it's a double blow. In the 1980s, Irish Waterford bought the English icon Wedgwood, whose dishes have graced elegant tables worldwide since the 18th century. But more than 200 years on, lifestyles have changed, and people just don't need as many dishes. Young people are so happy to have TV dinners. They're far more practical than my age group, where I always have had a best set. Talks are reportedly now underway with three interested buyers for this oh-so-British business, all of them from the United States. The receiver believes that it may be possible to sell the business as a going concern, which would be uh, very good for, for everyone. But, you know, there is uh, a certain question mark when the receiver comes in. Waterford was driven out of business once before by high taxes in 1851. That time it remained closed for a hundred years. Everyone's hoping for a speedier rescue this time, so the noble old company is a going concern again in time for New Year 2010. Elizabeth Palmer, CBS News, London.